It's football time in Tennessee. Those words have long been associated with running through the tee, the glory of the checkerboard end zone, and the big orange ready to do battle. Little gets the blood boiling. Why like a rivalry game? Barbs, shots, trash talk, things that go on throughout the week will now all be settled on this field. As we'll see a squad from the SEC, the Florida Gators, taking on the 15th ranked team in the land, the Tennessee Volunteers. For EA Sports College Football, Reese Davis with you alongside David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. Time to get this game started. So the Florida Gators offense will get the first crack at it here. These rivalry games can really get the blood. Talk about for years and years down the road. You have got to show up and play your best football in games like this. Oh, and they're getting it wrong. He's looking for an open man on second down. That's caught. It's Wilson. Excellent. Off the play fake on first down, wants to throw. He just throws it away, and I think the flag's going to be coming in. The there it is. Wow. Okay. Okay. Into the Ocho, eighth play of the drive coming up. Yeah. Looking for a man. It's Mertz. It's complete. They bring him to line up in different spots all over the field all game long. Defense has got to keep their eye on where this guy is because they know he's a big part of this offense's system. Touchdown, Florida! That is the ultimate grab and go for the score. You love as a head coach to watch your offense take the field and establish a rhythm and consistency the way they did there. Everything they dialed up was working to perfection. They go 10 plays on the opening drive and cap it off with a touchdown. Looking to pass, it's Iam Aleava. Throwing right. And the ball is picked off. What a nice catch by the defensive back. Listen, a lot of times you see DBs get in position to make plays, but there's a reason they play DB and not wide receiver. Great job finishing the interception, catching the ball, making a big play. job the offense was clicking everything went well Palmer they execute and got the touchdown and they were really on third and long he's gonna have to throw for it what a snag by the defense bringing it back and the interception was enough I think you put the ball right back in his hands and let him do his thing dropping back it's Iamaleava forced out of the pocket Across the 25, he's got move. He With the quarterback, nice job being on the same page. Nice completion, nice catch. Third and long, and he'll try to throw for it. He's going. And go for it on fourth down. And remember, from this spot, they can get a first down without scoring a touchdown. Into the end zone. And it's in. Lost to throw on first down. Buys a little time. He's looking on the right side. He's got it downfield for a huge game. Touchdown, Gator. Reeled it in and just made the house call. It was a really nice job on the route concept because they got the safety occupied, which opened up the deep middle of the field for the receiver on the post. He uses his speed. Nice job by the quarterback, putting it out in front of him. He makes the catch and then runs it into the end. going to wrap up the first half here and now we join Kevin with the halftime update. No better place to start this halftime than by reviewing how this wideout has been a one-man wrecking crew. The kid's been everywhere. 
And I love how he's willing to go across the middle, but that he also has the Jets to burn these DBs on the default. If this defense wants to actually come back in this one, they better hide his cleats. With that, let's throw it back to the guys to see how this rivalry matchup plays out. There on first down, it's second and five. Ready, go. Leaves it with the running back. That play just never had a chance at, and flew down with some bad intentions. To the air, it's Iamaleava. It's complete. He gets it all the way down. To the Up there, look there, third and long in field goal range. They go zone coverage, so everybody on the back end has the eye on the quarterback, and they're able to break on the ball, force the incompletion. It is perfect them to try to get a touchdown this time around Palmer they may have to get out of their comfort zone here too, David a little bit and just start being more aggressive and take some chances but that's what's gonna have to happen for them to win the for a ball. Roll, roll, on third and long you'll need to push it downfield complete out of the backfield not convert that third down and for the second time tonight they'll trot out the field goal kicker no Good. My goodness, you need those field goals, guys, to cut into that deficit. We're still at 11. The give to the back. What a nifty one there to plot here. He'll kick it from the left hash and 39 yards out. It's good. He could have hit a string right in the middle of the uprights there. And now the lead is even bigger. On that play, because of the pressure, it affected his accuracy. That's why the ball falls into the Here's a throw downfield late. Snags it down the right side. All kinds of running room. Touchdown ball. And once he found open space, the band might as well start playing. And listen, still trailing by a touchdown here in the fourth. They'll try to get it back with the onside kick. That's why they call them the hands team. They're able to secure the chin, and that'll do it. I know a lot of people thought this was going to be a blowout, but this team said, just when you think you have all the answers, I change the questions. That's so true, Reese. I mean, they had a lot of dudes that we were talking to leading up to this game just had a chip on their shoulder. They just didn't feel like they were being respected, and they wanted to come out, and they wanted to prove a point. David, they did exactly just that. And it's so much easier to be the underdog. It's so much easier to coach that team when you go, hey, they're ranked. Everybody's talking about them. You don't have a chance. It just builds all that momentum, all that hate, and you just pour it out on the field. So that's going to do it for us. For Jesse Palmer, David Pollock, I'm Reese Davis saying so long. This has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.